Okay, let's move on. So we have a postcard. Before handmade holes, there are some strange handwritten instructions in the back. Ah, postcards. I ring the bell, Santa, thy glory, O Lord. From the lowest unto the highest, and by the sacrament of a baptism shall I enter into your secrets. The postcard must also serve some other purpose that is pierced by the yeah, number of arrows. Okay. The will began in 1846, the same year Albert Marsh was first arrested, and the same year he founded his blasphemous order. It is hard not to assume a connection. As a congregation here, they managed, the town's folk begin to develop their natural characteristics that outsiders have come to call the inmost look. It started in the Marsh family, but spread across the town. For want uh, of any other, I coined the name Ichthys, Ich... what? Ichthyoses, okay. For the condition and began corresponding with a few medical men I had known in my student days. I was unable to determine the nature of the condition, how it spread and whether I was in danger from it. Both of my flock has deserted me, I couldn't desert them. I had to stay and fight this evil, or at least try to understand it. They do seem to avoid the ancient sigil that I discovered in one dusty tomb which called it as the Elder Sign. So it troubles me to rely on this instead of the cross, it does appear to offer more protection. Soon it became apparent that the condition was regarded as some sort of blessing by the adherents of Marsh's uh, ungodly faith. I noticed that those most heavily disfigured by it commanded respect from the others, and from time to time I overheard snatches of conversation about the pure blood, which from their context seems, uh, seemed not to refer to the blood of those untamed and healthy looking. There was talk of marriages, but no one came to me to be wed. Wives were sometimes mentioned but never named. They seemed not to be from Minsmouth, and yet no one has moved to the town since Mars Reagan began. As I walked the streets at dusk, which I seldom do, except at great need, I seemed to hear strange noises from unlit, curtained upper rooms in the town's houses. I hear of births, but conduct no baptisms. Those few who shun Mars Temple are fearful, and I am fearful too. We must be strong in our faith and in our lives, for we are all that remains of the true Innsmouth, and it's only hope of waking from this nightmare. Yep. You're trapped. Okay, There's no place so to we run. need to do everything quickly, because as I remember, they will burn us out. Cool. Stop lagging. Oh, as I understand, when it's green, it may it means I have maximum. Well, that's not awesome. Get well, okay. There's no way out of there. There's a raised section of tiling in the baptismal pool. You can't get away. Hmm. Uh, is there any, nothing else? I remember there was... The defacement of the church willing, must have happened many now. months ago. We'll not gut the gals, carcass. Oh, uh, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Just give yourself a look for us in your dreams. The order of mercy on your rotten soul. Get yourself a Cthulhu for Dom. Jesus Christ. There's no place you can run. Use your gift, Jack. Use the force here. Yeah. Open these doors, outsider! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, what did it say? From the lowest to the highest. Wait, what is lowest? This one's the lowest. Give yourself up, outsider. Yeah, okay. There's no way out of there. Okay, it moved. It moved. You can't get away! 
Just not to do all this again. If you're willing to come out, strange, I do remember that they were trying to burn me out. Well, maybe that's in another. In another place. There are markings everywhere. It must have been down here that Rebecca's father figured out that mysterious sign. It's a registry of births, deaths, and marriages in Innsmouth. And what's so cool about it? Ah, okay, let's look. Birth 7, 6 baptized, 1 died, 6, 5 buried, 1 lost at the sea, marriage is 5, all baptized, all baptized, ah yeah, a lot of died. Hmm. Ah, probably 7, no baptisms. Ah, uh, contain rocks and logs. Interesting. So what next? They all appear to be volumes on the history of Innsmouth. In the clippings, the year 1846 has been circled several times. Uh -huh -huh. It's the coffin of Tom Pickett who died in 1837, aged 49. It's the coffin of D. Slocum, who died in 1852, aged 27. It's the coffin of Tom oh, Pickett, okay. who died in 1837, okay, aged 49. Okay, we can save. Oh, look at here, wait. A small... The postcard fits exactly over the plaque. I can see some of the numbers. Uh, 1753. Uh, wait. 3. Uh, no, yeah, look. It starts from 3, yeah. Then it goes to 1, then it goes to 5. Then it goes to 7. 3, 1, 5, 7, yeah. Uh, 3, 1, 5, 7. And start to the right. Three, one, five, seven. What and nothing? I must have got something wrong. Ah. Uh, three, one, five. It appears to be. Some sort of oh code. wait, maybe. What if I, I will try it in another direction? Three. Uh, one. Five. And seven. Oh, okay. Yes, yes, that's it. I've cracked it. Yeah. The safe holds a stone cross. Okay, I don't remember where I used it. But we'll All see. these articles relate to the deaths of Innsmouth citizens. Yeah, shit happens. A small memorial to an old priest. It's the coffin of S. Lawrence, born 1789 and died in 1826. Ah, that's why I need it, okay. There's a small stone disc here. Hollowed out with the carving of an upside down cross. Okay, then. Secret passage. Smart. For a priest. Whoa. 
Am I alright? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> jump scares, jump scares, jump scares. I didn't forget it. Yes, it must be here. Prepare yourself. I have full me medicine. That's good. I don't remember, there must be jump scare with this girl. Strange. Maybe it will be later. Oh, maybe here. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, I think it's here. Fuck it. Okay. Uh, yes. Okay, now I remember this. Okay. What do I do? Blood. And we are in the bank. Oh, again? Come on. As I remember, there wasn't a lot of safe points. Maybe that's because I was worried. A slow poke. Search the area. Whoa. I think Search the area. Oh, okay, now I remember Spread that. Out. Search the area. Get Shit. Here, Some of the planks look weak. I better watch my step. I haven't heard anything, my friend. Oh, fuck. That's very awesome, but where, where do we go? Fuck. Ah, wait, I need to get there. Mm, 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 okay.
Pam, pam, pam. What the hell with you, man? Ah, oh, what next? What next? Whoa. Okay, sorry, my friend's game crashed. As I said, this might happen. Considering this game old, and don't forget. I hope this won't happen, but I had this one time already that, uh, well, it might happen that game will, cr will be crashing at, at one point and I won't be able to continue. But I hope it won't happen in this game. Mistaken, we need to jump here. Yeah? Search the area. Oh, yeah. Spread out. Search the area. But where do we go? Spread out. Search there the was area. this door here. Yeah. Spread out. I just. Ah, oh, wait, okay, maybe we can save it. Let's save it. And there was the door. Oh, yeah, I was... Forget that he, he is afraid. An old chest of drawers. Nothing of interest. Okay, and also I remember with this water tower it also took me like one hour to figure out what do I need to do. I mean to jump on this ladder. The radiator's cold. Search the area. And I was dying a lot. Search the area. Okay, good. Okay, we are full. Maybe we need to kill something. No. Well, we are lucky. Okay. Don't budge. Search the area. You need to be careful here. I think, I think you need to go there. Yes. Good. 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 I remember I was falling a lot in this. Hello, Jack. Whoa. Mackie, have you been tailing me? You could say that. Drop me a line Sorry, next time you're planning on taking the stealthy approach. I'll watch and take notes. Funny. I don't get it, Mackie. What's your angle on all of this? I already told you. I work for the government. I've got friends at the top. Friends who've invested a lot of time and dough in Innsmouth. They don't want to see their investigation set back by some private op turning up the heat with some mindless caper. If you mean the Burnham boy, they're gonna kill him, Mackie. You know it and I know it. I can't let that happen. You're not thinking of breaking him out. He's just a punk, Jack. Where's the jailhouse, Mackie? Search the area! Very well. It's your funeral. The window over there to your left looks over the jail back alley. Spread out! See you around, Mackie. Okay. 
Oh, okay, I can't talk to him. It won't open. Decorative vases and bowls. All of them empty. What can you tell me about the Order? They control all aspects of life in Innsmouth, Jack. Law, business, religion, politics, everything. Robert Marsh is the man at the top. He's a real recluse. No one born out of Innsmouth has set eyes on him in decades. The government has nothing on this Marsh fella? Only that he's an intensely religious man, obsessed with fanaticism and witchcraft. He's evil, Jack. Rumors round these parts reckon even Beelzebub himself lies in fear of Robert Marsh. Hmm. What about the rest of the Marsh family? Well, there's Sebastian, Robert's elder brother. He's the manager of the Marsh refinery. He's more of a businessman. There's gossip on the streets of a feud between the Spread brothers. Out. Hold on a second, Mackie. I thought Jacob Marsh was the refinery manager. Well, yes, he is. Jacob is Sebastian's son. He handles the day-to-day -day running of the place, but the real power lies with Sebastian. Okay, something else. Where's the jailhouse? The area. At the end of the main corridor. Just through the window. Thanks, Mackie. Where's the jailhouse? Oh, okay, nothing new. At the end of the main corridor. Just through the window. Thanks, Mackie. Spread out. Okay. Jailbreak. February 8, 1922. Early hours. Everything in this godforsaken town is out to kill me. Around every corner some hide a detained thug is searching. I've managed to avoid them so far. Though poor Rebecca wasn't so lucky, it's starting to look hopeless. Only Mikey doesn't seem to want me dead, and maybe he has an ulterior motive. His mention of investors in this town and his knowledge of the esoteric order clearly point to some level of involvement. Still he told me where to find Brian Burnham and he seems to pose no immediate threat. Even so, his apparent understanding of things in Innsmouth is unnerving. Am I becoming paranoid? After what I have seen and experienced, how could I know? The strain is certainly having an effect on my nerves. I am beginning to hear and see things that can't possibly be real. I need to ignore these distractions if I want to get out of here alive. My best chance is to find Brian and break him out of the jailhouse. To do that, I'll need a plan. Jailbreak. Some say that the worst monsters reside in the image. Imagination, drawn from the greatest fears of those who imagine them. I say there are horrors beyond mortal imagining. Well, okay then. It won't budge. Ta -ra -ta 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 -ta. Uh, <laughs> Okay, and I will stop here. Thanks for watching.